this is lesson three uh, i think bado you are following the first lessons liangazi about guitar and the things you need to do about guitar at least you need to know the tool of your work the second lesson tukajua ni wapi tutaanza kushika guitar the direction now we are on lesson three mambo ni pole pole tu each step is very important each step inatua, inatufunza something new as we said we are focusing on e tunaita kg so everything tuna focus hapo so songs zote and each chord will be focusing there so today tulikuwa tumesema tutajifunza now after kujua the first steps the first steps za guitar ni tunajifunza rhythm just short rhythm za waya tatu before we proceed so last time to jifunza can remind ourselves i have kila mtu sasa anaweza shika hivyo Now sasa after that wewe shindia the same at least song inahitaji kwenda climax ama unahitaji ku release so now that's where today's lessons comes in kushika what we call the v still three wires tulisema from here is na wire number 1 the string number 1 2 3 4 5 6 <laughs> so we are focusing on 2 3 and 4 now tulikuwa tumesema from kg tukishalalisha vidole hapa hii kidole the three wires naenda tena unainuka then hapo now those are the first steps now tumefika hapa naona hii kidole ya kidole ya pete mali imefika for you hii ni kg sasa kg you have unaenda to next mali kuna this the first dot the first dot hapa ndio nashikia v the first dot now nataka uangalie hizi vidole now hii ndio kidole ya kidole ya pete most of the time imeshika waya namba 4 haya venye ulikuwa unalalisha hapa zina jarange hivi unaona venye ina jarange hii inashika hii inashika hii inashika hii so now ukienda hapa to the next dot the next key just try to arrange hivyo tu that's another key tutakuwa tumetoka off key now tumende na wa key now hizi vidole mbili this one and this one you exchange their roles hii kidole ya kwanza ilikuwa inashika namba 2 hii sasa ndio itashika namba 3 alafu sasa hii kidole ya pili hii ndio ilikuwa inashika namba 3 itarudi namba 2 then utabaki na kitu kama hiyo tasikia sauti sasa Naona Simple way of kujua tumesema si tumeanza hapa Nao tuko kwa KG so amisha tu hivyo vidole zenye ziko tuzilete hapa next Of course it may sound off so now ukishika hivi you only need to do one thing hizi vidole mbili you exchange their roles moja ipande na ile nyingine ishuke simbo sasa utakuwa umeshika vi naona so so kwa hiyo gito nafaa kuwa nasikia hiyo sauti yes and your v nasema kidole ya pete iko kwa hii dot hapo hizi dot zionza ku guide so ukishikia hapo 
you have to finish because sasa unaona tumeanza hapa tume create a rhythm but now hapa kwa V hatuna any rhythm ya create unasikia tutamaliza aje now you see unaona hii kidole ya kwanza tulikuwa tunalalisha hii hapa sasa hii ndio tutatumia sasa kulalisha hapa juu now V tumesema tunashikia hapa so unalalisha hii sasa inashika those three wires one Unaona kwa hii sasa second dot here. Unaona? Then una skip. Now, fanya tulikuwa tunasema this is number 1 2 1 3. Tumeshatoka hapo sasa. Tukuje hapa sasa. This the V is number our number 1 now. Then hapa juu just flat 2 3 4. Sawa number 2. Sinaona kuna hii dot you skip to the next dot this number 3 now our number 3 so number 1 our b number 2 the first dot number 3 the second dot now shikanisha our fenye tulikuwa tunasema rhythm lazima ukreate a pattern now our is number 1 2 1 3 kwa tunasema tu hapa 1 2 1 3 because now we are from that lesson tumekuja kwa V now unakuja 1 2 1 now you can create a rhythm sawa number 1 1 then the first dot maalizo video ziko sawa 2 this our three so for you to create a rhythm you need a pattern so our pattern is 1 2 1 3 1 2 3 1 2 3 1 2 3 the first free ukishajua hapo now you can now unakumbuka hizi this was our one this was our two this was our one this was our three now for for now we are using this as our one the vs1 now now we can use this three and this two badala ya kulala hapa sasa we can even so this two and this three we can use them here so tuchukue sv our one So ukitoka hapa unarudi nyuma zile keys za kwanza tulikuwa tumesema the chords za kwanza. Unasikia sasa? Hivyo ndio narudi nyuma sasa. Now. Awa vi number 1 tu narudi hapa namba 3 yenye tulikuwa tume, tumesema hapo mbeleni unarufu nelo afi ndio ina release wimbo sasa now tuchukua uh, one of the reason fenje tulikuwa tumejifunza step at least to manage to make release wimbo so mena sasa you can use a v ku progression unasikia like unasikia song inaenda ina progress kuna hii song ya katitu ya kadhambi
Um. Inaenda ngayo progression tu. Unasikia inaenda chini inarudi. I can play it kidogo. chini kabisa so hapo ndio v inatumika aya most of the songs kuna songs mingi sana zimetumia v as their start point badala ya hapa unaona venye unatumia hapa some songs itaanza na hiyo v like it is their basic ya music hii like song ya katibu inaitwa ngoma siakwa unaona Anita the one of these last volumes Anita Anita ni unaona hii katibu inarudi But now unaweza shika hivi ya hapa kama hiyo ya Anita song na nyuma ama uende na mbele it depends venye rhythm yako inaingia song kama hii ya eh, kuna nyingine ya maima yes such songs hata za gospel ah uh, kama kuna moja ya gospel na yes we can tutajifunza baadaye but unasikia the basic is the v so it is the v now tume tume tumemaliza hapo hata even maima the introduction song lazima ile naingianga naye ndere ndere lazima ujue kucheza v still we are on key g so kila kitu yote tutafuata this key so definitely your song ya mama kwa kiji taingilia hapa ndorote hiyo ni avi
kuja sasa mbali kilianzia so ki narudi nyuma now tumesema tumejifunza vi kupanda sasa tumeona kutoka hapa tunaenda vi ndio tunaanza kulala tena hiyo ni release song now kuna kurudi nyuma sasa wakati nao wa climax still utatumia vi lakini sasa hapa hii kidole sasa ndio italala si unaona ulikuwa unaenda hivi V here right away unapaa kuwa nashika V hapa tulisema V hii kidole inashika namba 2 3 and 2 3 4 4 so from the key unatumia sasa unalala na hii kidole sasa au utalala na hii because hii is convenient wakati unapanda wakati unashuka you start sasa unalala na hii kidole hapa usisahau you are still using the three strings 1 2 3 so so unalala na hapa v now unarudi tena na v so ukilala hapa kila waya ina skip one fret so still ni v so now ukishika hivi utasikia the first kama you on the right key utasikia hiyo ndio sauti you skip one each maskia sauti sasa now use this as your number one this as your number two and this as number three number one number two as we always say let's create a rhythm you have to create a pattern so our pattern as always be 1 1 2 1 3 1 2 evo 1 2 3 now let's factor in a song kama the first rhythm tutenye tulikuwa tunajifunza nayo nataka kwenda climax sasa sa so this is the convenient one wakati unarudi because uweze rudi hivi na ukuje kwa v it is it, it's not convenient so sasa inaingia wakati ya kale kason kasomu sasa ndiyo kana ingianga after si unajua that's during the normal wakati mnaimba na solo climax so song is standard to hapo TV but now that will be our next sasa kuna venye unafaa ushuke sasa ndio sasa climax ifike mwisho sio kama ufika hapa still kiji so kuna hiyo 
progression sasa so now a simple song Without that V, where's the one your progression? So, so many answers happen. Unaweza hanza a song anywhere and you go across hizo chords sote nimesema. Unaweza hanza anywhere, utembee, urudi, utembee, urudi. You can even start here. So you can start at the V. the way song when I end right? you can always frame so musisao tumesema v when you tulianza lesson 1 tukasimama you just move just the next hapa kuna hii dot try to arrange hizo vidole venye umezoea hivi then the only thing you need to do is to overturn hizi vidole mbili moja iende chini ingine ipande then now train your vidole zijue kushika hivyo zikishajua kushika hivyo now you can unaweza now train yourself on the progression kupanda kushuka so the easiest way to train yourself let a vidole hapa remember ukisongeza una exchange hizi mbili tu mali ingine na shika zina exchange hizo waya so you train yourself mpaka zizoea That is the V now. So that's for today for today's lesson. Next lesson sasa tutafunza ka solo kidogo. Oh, and you there are some people who are interested in solos. So tutajifunza solo ya waya mbili kwanza because that's where you start. Ukishajua ukishaelewa waya mbili before sasa ukuje huko solo is ni kubwa sana so you can't uweze can change the notes zote because solo now una play na note hii ngine una play na chord not ni sauti unaona solo hiyo ni ile complicated ya but now kuna zile songo simbo very simple now there are only one pros one one ni format ukishajua hiyo format solo zote utapata zinaingia hapo the same too 